What's good guys, if you want cheap, fast, and reliable NBA 2K20 MT as well as NFL 20 Muck Coins, please go to dvdj.com, link will be in the description, use code BUGS for 10% off at checkout. What's good YouTube, it's your boy BUGS back on another NBA 2K20 My Team video. And as you guys can see, there's only 4 hours left on the pack, so that means a market crash is coming. So, before we get into the video, drop a like, comment, sub if you are new, because... Um, we're gonna wait 10k MT so drop whatever you want in the comments to qualify videos got to hit 25 likes This is a video that's gonna inform you on that the market crash is coming But before we get into the market and all that good stuff Let's pop this free pack we spun the wheel and we got a pack so maybe we could pull something we're still trying to complete these spotlight challenges, so Let's get it. Let's get it. And of course, we get nothing good. We get an emerald, and it is Jerome Kershey. That is actually not bad. I guess it's not bad. We'll send it all to our auctions. Um, Kershey goes for a decent amount. Let's check out his price. But yeah, guys, today we're going to get a huge market crash. If you guys did not sell your players, I'm giving you one last shot to sell your players. Um, let's see how much. I think Kershey's around 5k. Let's see, 14, 60, 900, 6K, 65, 59. All right, we're going to sell them for 5K. That's not bad. I'll take that for free. That's not a bad pack right there. 5,500 for free. I'll take it. It's better than getting nothing, bro. Sell them for 55. We'll pull up this Pacers jersey for like 1K or something. Hopefully it sells. So that pack right there was about 6K. Not bad. It's free. I'll take it any day. As you can see, we got our MT racked up. We're ready for this market crash. We'll be posting a video on the new content too. So new content is dropping today. Possibly a new spotlight series. I would like to see like a Dirk or something. Um, I don't know. Maybe they'll drop something really cool. Maybe a stud. Hopefully a stud. Hopefully really good content today. But yeah, let's get into the market. So right now, everything is still kind of cheap, which means today is going to be a crazy day to snipe. Um, everything is going to be really, really, really cheap. Probably the cheapest it's ever been. Um, NBA 20 Amethyst, like I said, we're going to rise to like 30k. They did not. They, uh, they were down at like 90k. Now they're at like 24, 25, like Kawhi, Harden, all them. So if you guys did not sell, you guys got to get on the auction. I'm posting this video at like 10 a.m. This is pre-recorded by like four hours. So as you can see, bro. Everything's still really cheap besides like Curry, Giannis, but they're going to drop too. So let's get into that. So Harden, all of them are around 25K. So if you do not sell, bro, go on the auction, go sell. So let's check out Curry. Curry's at 37, which is really cheap. He'll be at 30K base today. So you guys today, to make MT, you pretty much want to cop all these cards that they're low. So I'm going to give an outcome. All right. So 45K for Giannis. All right. So today... Giannis is going to be under 40k for the first time um, He's going to probably be at 35k, which is literally so cheap So if you could pick him up for under 30k, that's a big dub for you Giannis at under third under freaking 40k is going to be crazy um, He's going to rise to probably 50k on like Sunday or Monday So yeah Today's content is going to create a crazy thing with the auction. Like, everything's still cheap, so I can't even imagine what the new content's going to do. And let's also check out the new spotlight players that are going out of hacks. So, pretty much, if you have Pippin, I think I'm going to go pick up a Pippin right now. Because I saw him for like 27k, but I don't know if the auction crash is going to drop, uh, make his price go down. I feel like 27k is not a bad price, but it's kind of scary because I don't want to lose MT. 27 and 30 it's not a bad price to keep because he is going to be out of packs. But then again, everyone still has to spin the wheel. Like, I doubt people spun the wheel yet. It's really early in the day. So his price might go down. A lot of Scotties might get pulled. Meaning, I don't know if you should pick him up. It's up to you. But So this is what happens. When the market crash happens, uh, which when new content comes, market crashes, a lot of people pull packs. So what happens? Every Amethyst in a game drops a ton. So... Pretty much my snipe method when the uh, market crash happens is just simply going to add this 20 uh, NBA 20 and going over here to like 28k and just scrolling through just seeing if you can find a cheap one and selling later So this is what I'm gonna tell you guys So all these amethyst all these amethyst 20s you want to try to get for 20k or under right now They're at 25. They should be a little more expensive, but they're not meaning that their price their new price is around 25k base which means 
if their price is at 25k base you want to snipe them for 20k now like these amethysts are already going to be under 20k during this market crash which is really cheap it's going to be the cheapest they've ever been which means when they're under 20k or 20k under you want to try to pick up as many as you can even if you see that their price is 20k base you still want to pick up as many as you can because throughout the week when the packs get slower and drier and people stop pulling them ever since like the first day um people you're gonna see them rise i would say like sunday monday and that's when you want to sell and make your mt we'll have a video on that tomorrow on like how you're gonna make mt off this how i made mt off of it after the market crash all that good stuff so yeah we're gonna be home we're gonna we're coming back from work for like 30 minutes to make a video for you guys uh showing the market crash showing the new content and yeah so let's get into it let's see what other cards we can look at real quick i'm gonna tell you what to buy what to sell all that good stuff so right now i'm gonna recommend all of you guys to just simply sell every single every card you have if you don't sell you're gonna lose max mt like that's enough said if you don't sell now you have a shot of losing 10k mt a card because every week bro every time they drop packs the market crashes the market never never goes up when packs come out especially new spotlight series packs a lot of people are going to try to pull these packs just so they can get the the new spotlight series done they're dropping a new spotlight series i don't know what it is yet just stay tuned for that when they drop it you got to hop on the auction asap i would say like 10 minutes after the packs drop um try sniping the new amethyst that they drop and try sniping these amethyst 20s um you could check ad for some reason ad Giannis, and curry are the most expensive well i mean i understand why so since they're, mo they're most expensive you want to try to stay on their snipe filter but you can also try sniping hard and kawaii and all them but as you can see yo ad is still really cheap if he's at 33k he's gonna be like probably 27 28k under which is the cheapest he's ever been his base was at like 40k last week 44k last week his base is at like 34 35 which means everything's gonna be the lowest ever so pretty much every week i see these amethysts dropping going up a little bit then dropping even more sooner or later these amethysts are gonna be 15 to 10k which is kind of crazy but if you have any cards i mean anything like any any card at all an amethyst a diamond e even like rubies bro Go ahead on the auction, sell them, try to make double the MT like I'm going to try to do today. As you can see, I have 355k. I sold most of my cards. I still have a lot of cards. As you can see, my collector level's up there. It's nothing crazy, but it's definitely up there. I would say, what do I have? I have over 500 cards collected, uh, which is a lot. If I sell them for like all 1,000, which is pretty accurate. If I sell all my cards for 1,000, that's 500k MT. And that's just that's just minimum a thousand which pretty much every card you have should go for at least i would say at least 500 to a thousand but then there's also other cards that i have for like 10k 20k so bro <clears throat> you gotta try to rack up at least at least 50k to 100k just by selling cards to be honest at this point in the game you should have at least 50k racked up ready to go this is the best time to snipe it's the hottest the auction will ever be um i'm telling you um also let's talk about some amethyst clyde drexler so this collection we got pippin and elijah one now if you want to snipe these cards they will be out of packs but it is iffy because people are spinning the wheel i just got oh that, that pack out of the wheel spin so you never know but if you did not do the spotlight challenges and you're trying to get a brandon roy like i'm gonna bid on him right now for 100k hopefully i get him but yeah pretty much what you want to do is just simply sell cards wait until the market crash happens and you pretty much right when the market crash happens everything just seems to drop and it's so easy to pick up and snipe cards like like i said so for out of this 20 just make sure that the cards are around uh like 20k or under for like harden Kawhi, and paul george other than that curry should be under 30k cop ad should be under like 26k cop and the honor should be under 40k with the cop so any of those prices that's what you want to get them at and then resell them on like sunday monday and you'll make maximum mt but anyways guys that's all i got for you until the new content drops i hope you enjoy have a good one peace